welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another sims 4 video so today i'm finally ready to show you guys what the new update for the simply unique save file looks like where i have completely redone hinford on bagley as well as tortosa this is my biggest save file so far where every world is filled with new builds built by amazing creators i would not have been able to create this save file without the help of my very dear and talented friends who gave me permission to use their builds in my save file. You will find that every world is filled with new builds built by these amazing creators all over the world. I also went ahead and filled both Granite Falls and Salva Dorada with builds as well. Inside of Granite Falls I also have replaced the Hermit's house with a newly built house by Sims Pandy and the Magic Headquarters in the Magic Realm of Realm of Magic I have replaced with a new newly built headquarters by tea time simmer as you guys will see i do hover over some of the builds giving you guys a little bit of info about what i've done in terms of credit because i do want to give credit to every single creator who is a part of the save file so once you click on the information panel you guys will be greeted with more information in terms of the creator and who has created the builds so be sure to go and check out the information panel to see more i also do leave their youtube channel links for you guys there in the information panel because i do feel like once you just copy and paste that url you can go straight to the youtube channel and check out the beautiful creations by that creator i also recently added more sims to the save file because i did have a lot of you guys ask me to please add more sims because you guys wanted more sims to play with as well as more background stories so i did just that because you guys asked and i had to deliver so recently i added a post on twitter asking you guys to submit your sims to the gallery if you wanted them to be a part of the save file and i'm really excited to be telling you guys that every single person who has submitted their sims and gave me permission to use their sims will find that their sims are indeed in the simply unique save file so i do give you guys a little bit of a glimpse of some of the sims as i do scroll through them and giving you guys a little bit of the background stories i really am so excited because these background stories guys is insane so i do give every single person who has created a sim or whose sim i have used in the save file you guys will see in the sims description i do give the person responsible for that sim or that house so credit where credit is due so be sure to go and check out who exactly created which sim also be sure to go and check out their background stories because let's face it guys some of those background stories are really saucy and i personally can't wait to play with this save file i am actually thinking of starting a let's play where i'll be playing just casually um 
with some of these sims and just see where things go from there so like i said in my previous update video i did not want to fill every world with a bunch of sims because i still wanted you guys to be able to have your sims live there and make friends with some of the sims that i created as well as the sims that you guys created and then of course i also did add a bunch of christy white t's sims into the save file since she gave me permission to use a bunch of her sims so thank you so much Chrissy for that I really do love all of the background stories but like I said I did not want to fill every single world and every single lot with a bunch of sims I still wanted to leave a bunch of houses unoccupied because of the reason that I wanted you guys to still be able to create more sims that you wanted to add to the save file as well so therefore you will find that not every single world nor every single build is filled with a household there are some houses well there are a bunch of houses that are unoccupied but i do feel like you guys can go and add more sims to the save file um, to your preference you guys will also find that some of the builds are not completely furnished where there is only like bathrooms rooms and kitchens furnished kind of like the idea where your sim moves in like from scratch because in real life when you move into a house it only has the bathroom and the kitchens <laughs> basically um, there for your use so you basically bring your own furniture so I did want to like give that feel to the save file so some of the houses do have bathrooms and kitchens furnished but you have to add your own furniture but there are not a lot of those builds but however there are some of them so if you do find some of the builds that only have kitchens and bathrooms please know that that is the reason why i also do want to point out that you guys should remember that since this is a save file you will have to place the file into your saves folder of the sims 4 located in the electronic arts folder after doing this you are ready to play with the save file i also do want to point out that you do however need all the packs up to date for the save file to work correctly so please be sure that once you download the save file you have to have all of the packs otherwise the save file is gonna have a bunch of items missing and so with that said i do want to take the time to once again thank you all so much and thank you so much to every single creator that is a part of the save file it really means so much to me to be working with people all around the world who is so talented I would really love to hear your guys' thoughts and opinions and let me know in the comments down below what is your favorite world from this save file so far. And since I know that a lot of you guys do not have all of the packs and you do still want to have some sort of save file in your game, don't fear because I also have a base game save file. So if you guys don't have all of the packs, don't worry, I got you covered. You guys can go and download the base game save file which will also be linked down below. Low. recently i have had a lot of complaints where you guys have told me that the sim file share link that i have posted for the downloads is not always working and you guys are struggling to download the save files so i did take the time to get you guys another alternative download link which is for google drive so you guys can go over there if the sim file share one does not work for you so be sure to go and check that out all of the download links will be down below in the description if you guys are interested to see a little bit more in terms of builds and where I give a little bit more of an in-depth like showcase of the save file from previous updates be sure to go and check that out as I will leave those videos for you guys linked down below as well I would also like to ask you guys to please be sure and go and show some love to every single content creator responsible for the save file as well as all of the wonderful people who have submitted their sims because all of their gallery ids will be linked in the description as well and like i said if you hover over the sims information panel in the game it will show you which sim was created by who and you guys can get the gallery id there as well so thank you so much once again to every single person responsible for this save file i really am excited to see where the save file goes in the future when new packs come out i will try my best to have an update as soon as possible or at least when I do have the opportunity to get all of the packs. I also do want to say thank you so much to all of you guys, my subscribers,
subscribers. I really do appreciate all of your love and support throughout the three years that I've been creating content. I really do love creating these safe holes for you guys. And the reason that I don't only add my builds and my sims into the safe hole is because I really want to showcase your guys' creations. I really feel like it's so much better for me to show you guys all of the amazing creations that is out there for the sims 4 so i really hope you guys like this save file let me know in the comments down below what you think if you like this video please give it a like and if you have not already please consider subscribing as it would mean the world to me if you already have become a part of the unique family thank you so much for all your love and support i really do appreciate it if you guys are interested to download any of my builds personally i do have my gallery id linked in the description so go check it out and go get some of my builds if you wish so with all of those things out of the way be sure to get one of my two save files which will be linked down below i hope you guys have an awesome day wherever you are in the world please stay safe and i will see you guys in the next video bye